Good morning. It's a Thursday and it's about half past nine or thereafter. I put the hat on because uh, I heard on the radio that there's going to be an early rain which will clear hopefully. Um, I did notice last night when I was going to get the spaghetti bolognese that there was a it wasn't raining but there was like a fine shower like it was stopping it uh, so I sensed there was some something in the air and uh, so yeah so I thought I'd put the hat on just in case there might be some light showers while I go in the car and go to Tesco and uh, get some more supplies i.e. breakfast consisting of two cheese sandwiches um, some more crisps, I'm down to my last Pringles which is the, to the, to the Tortilla Sour Cream Fiesta um, I'm okay for water and beetroot juice and I think I might get some digestives, I was missing some biscuits with my coffee yesterday so that's it, I'm gonna hop up to the car now, get some supplies, come back here and uh, edit yesterday's video. After that, I don't know, the way was really nice, I'll try and get out this time. Well, so I'll be out in the rays a bit longer than yesterday. Right, off I go. you know what? I had an, a thought. I thought to myself, I better write it down because I'll only forget it. And then I got distracted. Something simple like pulling the chair away or laying the table. And uh, that's it. I didn't write it down quick enough because I've forgotten whatever it was I was supposed to remember and to write down so I wouldn't forget and now I can't, for the life of me, I can't remember what it was Right, as you can see, I'm in the car and uh, it's not a long distance to the car, it's a road which I take for granted and actually it's proved quite useful in the past in terms of uh, finding a space first time and it's not too far from the hotel so really if I can't find one in my road or in an adjacent road I should come to this road which is like an adjacent road to an adjacent road if you know what I mean right the sun's out I don't need this hat on anymore uh, I also remembered to put the umbrella back in the boot as well as one of the shopping bags. So I've uh, achieved a few things today. And I'm going to start the engine. <laughs> right, let's get this, uh, I was going to say video going, but somebody else says that. So I won't say it. Right, let's get this car going. <laughs> Well, I've got nothing from Tesco today. I picked up two sandwiches. They didn't have the digestives I wanted. They didn't have the crisps I wanted. I was gonna, I didn't fancy getting another Pringles to be honest. Um, they didn't have the deodorant I wanted. And the cheapest aftershave is ten pounds. And I just can't help remembering uh, seeing sandwiches at Morrison's just up the road for like 
a pound. They're doing a bargain, a deal. With that in mind, I'm going to try Morrison's and see. Well, do a price comparison. Right, that's where I'm going next. Right, I've just been to Morrison's and I've got all the things I wanted. I've got the crisps, the digestives, deodorant and two sandwiches and they all came to just under four pounds. How about that? When you they are doing a deal on the sandwich, otherwise it would have cost the same as Tesco, so you can equally or better Tesco at the moment and it's quite a nice drive here I actually uh, got lost at one point so I had to uh, double back um, I would then I found my way so right I've got my stuff um, I'm gonna head back to the hotel have my sandwich because I'm hungry a cup of coffee and then I was thinking of editing yesterday's video at the moment the weather is really lovely it's so it's really hot but then again I'm in the car so it's uh, it's hotter or hot at that outside is quite nice I noticed the seafront the sea the, the waves were quite um, you know, lashing. Um, I know there's a hurricane. Is it a hurricane, Michael? Uh, so I'm heading this way from Florida. I think it's heading towards Georgia. And and according to the news, it's going to head. I suppose that's the North Atlantic drift, which means it all come to our shores no doubt October November is usually uh, the time we get the gales I think it marks the change in the season in a sense in my thinking right I'm rabbiting on and I should be heading back to the hotel to have my breakfast and off I go
myself. I'm back in the room and uh, yeah she's gone it's just gone one o'clock as well so uh, I'll uh, came watching the two films which were I think it was the black knight with Alan Ladd and the ferry across Hong Kong or ferry to Hong Kong with Orson Wells yeah so I'll uh, well, in fact, what I'll do is I'll, while I'm watching them, I'll transfer yesterday's footage onto the flash drive via the laptop and then proceed with the edit. But it was raining. No, Twilight. I mean your real name. The name you have kept secret. My real name is Eisenstein. It's just gone 7 p.m. and I'm currently exporting yesterday's, uh, Wednesday's video. And watching Talking Pictures TV or Film 4, whichever. I want to just turn the telly on anyway, so I don't know exactly what's on. Well, I've just ordered a, a kebab from a shop that was uh, a mile away uh, through Just Eat and uh, had it delivered to the hotel which is another first I ordered it at, at uh, 10 past 8 and 10 minutes later uh, it arrived what I did was I uh, 
I sat in the lobby and started watching Talking Pictures TV and uh, I asked them not to ring the doorbell so I got a phone call, the car pulled up and I saw it, saw it was them and uh, they called me as well and uh, I went out, picked it up and uh, here I am, I'm about to uh, eat it all up <laughs> At the same time, my video, uh, yesterday's video, has gone live on YouTube. So I'll probably watch it, see how it turns out, and uh, whilst I'm having my dinner. It gives me opportunity now to thank you for watching this video. And uh, enjoy the rest of your day. And I'll see you, hope to see you in the next one. Goodbye.